Welcome everybody to the Glendale Public Library. My name is Michael Beck. I'm Chief Librarian for the City and it's my honor and pleasure to welcome Secretary Reagan on a visit and in presenting our Library Services and Technology Act Grant Award Check. In addition to Secretary Reagan, I would like to welcome the Honorable Mayor Gary Wires and Council Member Bart Turner and Library Advisory Board Chair Jessica Corey and other dignitaries to our library. It is my pleasure to now introduce the Honorable Mayor Jerry Wires for some remarks to Secretary for Secretary Reagan's presentation. Okay, I'll keep mine very short. Uh, first of all, um, I'm going to call her Michelle because her and I actually served together and, and I consider her a good friend of mine. Welcome to Glenville. We're very proud to have you come here and Thank you. Uh, even more proud to have you come here uh, with our relationship that we've had over the years. Uh, with that said, we are very proud of our library system for receiving this grant. Uh, you know, any time that you can receive money at no cost, that's, that's pretty nice. And the fact that the state is uh, supporting what the city is doing, that, that makes it even additionally nice. So thank you so much for paying attention to this. I uh, also would like to thank Michael uh, and, and your team. Uh, you know, I, I, I still think frequently you guys are underappreciated. I really believe that. I think uh, with the amount of work that you put in the program and the different things that you do, and, and you don't do one thing, you're kind of like all over the place. You, you really do a lot of different things. So, uh, to you and your team, uh, thank you so much for what you do for our city. Uh, you know, in this uh, uh, library, not this library, but all three libraries, we had well over a half a million, uh, 600,000 plus uh, visits. So uh, a lot of people are saying libraries are a thing of the past. And I, I think just often yeah, think libraries are looked at differently today. In my time of growing up, you would have never seen DVDs and computers and things like that. So it's still accomplishing the same goals, just being done differently. So uh, with that, uh, we're very proud, uh, Secretary, to have you here. Uh, so all of you know, uh, Michelle and I served in the House of Representatives together, and she still has my couch. And so I'm still trying to get my couch back. But uh, welcome to Glendale. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thank you so much. Well, it is certainly wonderful to be um, out here in your community tonight. And uh, Michael, this is an absolutely gorgeous library. Um, we are uh, particularly thrilled, too, to uh, be distributing these funds close to home, um, close to the capital. The uh, last couple of grants we gave were out in rural communities, which is also um, wonderful to, to get the money spread out around the state. But what I found really, really uh, neat about this grant was that um, in relation to some of the other grants that were uh, more geared towards um, children, this grant was geared towards something that's often overlooked, and that's teenagers and um, adults and the ways that they are using their libraries. Something that we're seeing all across Arizona and all across the country, which is so exciting, is that libraries are a place where people are coming together as a community. You know, when I was growing up, libraries were a place where people came um, to read and to be very quiet, and a librarian would come and tell you, shh. Um, libraries aren't like that anymore. And it's exciting to see the libraries now in Glendale um, also following suit. They're a place where um, community members can come and learn and explore and that's what this grant is all about and the grant that was written and we are so proud of um, the fact that it was written and that we're able to uh, to be here to, to give it out the goal of this project is to provide creative programming for all ages in all three branches of your Glendale Public Library and the funds are going to be used for multiple hands-on programs for your residents to discover and enjoy new mediums of self-expression. Um, the community is really going to benefit by learning how to share their different creative visions through different artistic means. And um, this is one of our larger grants that we're passing out this year. So again, it is very, very exciting that I'm able to be here with my friend, um, Mayor Wires, to be able to present to your library a very big check. <laughs> in the amount of nearly $24,000, $23,950. So please, congratulations. <laughs> and I thought it was a gallon of grant to come and take a picture because she's the reason why you got this. Congratulations, Glendale. Thank you. 
right through here. I'm not sure it's going to fit through that drive through window very well. <laughs> <laughs> What's more through here? <laughs> Come on. Take turns. What's more through here? All on? Take turns. Got it. That's going to be heck to endorse. Yeah. Yeah. And it doesn't fit in the ATM. We're supposed to put all checks in the safe, so I'm not sure how it's going Thank you, Secretary Reagan. The Glendale Main Library resides in the Barrel District, and it is my pleasure to now introduce Councilmember Bart Turner for a few comments. Thank you, Michael. Thank you all for being here today. Um, I know that we all understand that libraries are much more than just books on shelves. Um, libraries host citizenship classes, they teach computer skills, they provide assistance to job seekers, and they also provide innovative resources to small businesses. Libraries offer morning story times to preschoolers that fuel their imaginations and encourage early childhood literacy. Um, they also stock the latest bestsellers, and that promotes leisure reading opportunities for people of all ages. Our Glendale Public Libraries work in conjunction with our local school districts to provide students not only a place to complete their schoolwork, but we provide students access to a network of global resources in which to conduct their research projects and research assignments. So with all of that in mind, and with the grant that we're receiving today to extend and expand the services that we provide to our Glendale residents, I'd like to extend my own thanks to Secretary of State Michelle Reagan for personally coming out here to Glendale on behalf of the Institute for Museum and Library Services in Washington, D.C. to present that giant size check for $23,950 as far as I know, Public Library. Thank you. Well, the staff and I thank Secretary of State Reagan, Mayor Wires, Councilmember Turner, for being such staunch library advocates and basically supporting what we're trying to do with libraries and bettering our community. Thank you so much for being here. The staff and I would also like to thank the State Library and Jamie Ball, the Deputy Director of State, or Deputy State Librarian, is also present. So, provide the resources and benefits that over 55,000 Glendale residents attended the Glendale program last year. So, we thank, I thank Meredith Jensen Benjamin and her grant writing team for a job well done and for each of you attending tonight. I encourage you to please look around our library, network with fellow Glendale, Glendaleans. And then also sign up for a library card if you haven't done so yet. And if you, and if you enjoy some library refreshments, we'll be happy to have you as our guests. Thank you for attending tonight. Shoulder, shoulder, shoulder. Big smiles. We were smiling. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go and you go. Uh, go ahead and let's rotate okay, it through. everybody say shh. Oh, no, we don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you and me? Okay, everybody right here? Thank you. Did you get it? Okay. Right here, please. And one more over here. Yeah, let me change mode. Okay, right through here. Carrier my obligatory colorway. <laughs> Well, the number of people yeah, you have to wait for everybody right. to close their eyes at least once. Is she taller than me? No, not, not too bad. Okay, now I'm going to switch this over to stills, okay? So just hang on a second.